Hello everyone and thank you for watching this video. My name is Tonico Jackson Martinez, Marketing Manager at Loop AI Labs. I will be your host for this session. Today we are going to talk about Cognitive Artificial Intelligence. In this session we will walk through what is Cognitive AI, how it's different from AI, some real world use cases, and how Cognitive AI changes how people work. Let's dive in. International Data Corporation, or IDC, defines Cognitive Artificial Intelligence AI systems as a set of technologies that uses deep natural language processing and understanding to answer questions and provide recommendations and direction. Artificial Intelligence, or AI, is one of the components to a cognitive application that contributes to machines learning from data and making decisions, suggestions, or discoveries. Cognitive AI consists of machines that strive for human capacity digital intelligence. Learning from human created dark data and reasoning to make decisions with the mindset to emulate the human thought process and produce similar results. There are two different fields of cognitive AI, supervised versus unsupervised. Supervised AI starts from a generic industry specific model or framework for each customer, that model is manually updated and customized by a team of human data scientists. This method is time and resource intensive and not scalable. Unsupervised AI creates models that are uniquely client specific, meaning no two models are exactly alike. No humans are needed for the learning phase. Key characteristics of unsupervised methods are the technology is language agnostic. The technology learns in the language or languages that the data comes in, just like a human or native speaker. The technology learns and reasons based on observing or ingesting the best human created data, continuously learning more. This method is scalable as the needs of the organization increase. The model automatically updates to include new information with no human intervention. We at Loop AI Labs have the only commercial unsupervised cognitive computing technology available. Let's move on to taking a look at some use cases to see several examples of how organizations around the world are utilizing unsupervised cognitive computing. We can take a look at customer support routing in the traditional or non-cognitive way. The process begins when a customer submits a service ticket. That ticket arrives to an agent who must then select the best suited competency center and agent to process the customer ticket, noting that if this step is done incorrectly, it can be costly. The agent then routes the ticket to a competency center. The receiving agent processes the request, sometimes taking up to seven days to issue a decision. Then finally, the agent's answer is received by the customer. Loop AI Labs uses Cognitive RPA to augment the traditional routing method. We call the solution micro-routing. The value of this solution is that when the service ticket is received, the Q robot routes it directly to the best suited department specialist, accelerating the speed of service and giving the specialist the agency to give their best service to their customers. Over time, as LoopQ continuously observes and learns from human employees, it is able to predict the likely answer to inbound requests based off the outcomes of past similar tickets and by utilizing confidence level. This is a great solution for accommodating the learning curves of new employees and standardizing the service of all agents. Depending on the desires of the client, answers can come in one of two forms fully automated answers sent directly to customers based off confidence level with a threshold set by the client, or a list of answer options for human agents to choose from, for example, A, yes, B, no, because, or C, upgrade for this service. Moving on to another use case. IDC data shows that knowledge workers spend about two and a half hours per day, or roughly 30% of their workday, searching for information. 60% of company executives felt that time constraints and lack of understanding of how to find information were preventing their employees from finding the information they needed. Based on a free text question, Loop Q finds the most important passages of the documents where the topic is explained and presents them to the agent by relevance or confidence level from a data lake of company information. 
This is an ideal solution for government, banking and financial services, insurance, legal, logistics, pharmaceuticals, customer support, research, and knowledge retention. And moving on to another popular use case. There is some knowledge that one can only gain by hands-on experience. It isn't written in any manual or procedure. When employees leave your company, that precious knowledge goes with them. Your employee's corporate knowledge is locked away in emails, old notes, manuals, training documents, reports, decision logs, and documents in a variety of styles, formats, and often many languages. LoopQ is able to train on all of that information and build a cortex to be used for applications such as cognitive search. With the tribal knowledge solution, one question asked receives an answer that is based on hundreds of experts' aggregated know-how. And now for another use case. The telecommunications industry is utilizing deep user profiling to better understand their customers. Using unsupervised cognitive computing to understand usage habits, preferences, and general sentiment for sophisticated marketing campaigns. LoopQ uses cognitive RPA to scan competitor websites, social media, and customer forum comments. LoopQ then presents this activity on a real-time, sophisticated cognitive dashboard. From this visual representation of competitor benchmarking insights, the client was able to create timely campaigns relevant to specific areas or targeted demographics. When you know your customers better, you sell better. We have entered into a new chapter of our technology history. Economist Andrew McAfee wrote, one could argue that today digital technologies are doing for human brain power what steam engines and related technologies did for human muscle power during the industrial revolution. They're allowing us to overcome many limitations rapidly and to open up new frontiers of unprecedented speed. He closes with, it's a very big deal. The revolution has already begun. The time to act is now. Enterprises are already seizing the opportunities to make the most of their data assets and to unlock their competitive advantage. New team dynamics are always an adjustment. It's no different when incorporating digital employees to the team. Remember that working smarter is always the goal. Many human employees are facing mixed emotions and worrying about their job security. Think of digital employees as a support system for your role, not competition. There are many operational benefits to be had with the support of AI. One, increased productivity. Giving human agents the speed and accuracy to handle cases with a newfound confidence because they're making fully informed decisions. Two, increased capacity. Human agents can now handle a higher volume of cases per day, easily scaling to meet the demand of their customers. Three, sharpen compliance. Human agents can now be sure that their decisions are in line with company regulations and administrative processes. Four, better at assessing risk. With more information and better fraud detection, human agents can be better prepared to assess risk. Employee benefits are also increased with the support of AI. One, better engagement. With digital employees gathering information and presenting it to human employees, human agents are able to deeply interact with each case, giving their full attention to the details for the best possible customer service. Two, wellness and support. With information readily available, human agents feel less stress and pressure to search and discover the correct answer. Three, insights for personal, professional assessment and development. Automatically communicate with HR on new skills acquired and potential development opportunities for growth. That's all for today. Thank you for joining us.